Oh, I'm a bit emotional after seeing my son graduate over Zoom. Oh my God. So over YouTube now, <laughs> how do you learn to code? I get that question asked a lot. And my advice is YouTube. Well, here's a couple of channels I've discovered in the last couple of weeks, and I just want to recommend them to you. Dev as Life, beautiful Japanese JavaScript developer. He also has a, an app. And the way he makes the videos are incredible. I'm, I'm blown away. His style is not quite mine. I mean, he's more aesthetic and, uh, yeah, his stack is quite complex for, for my liking. But I, re I really recommend his videos. Do check them out. Now, someone pretty controversial, uh, Naomi. Um, she's the real deal, and she said something extremely wise. And this is this is I'm just going to read. This is my video right here. How to so code. If this is your first time coding. Here's how it works. First time, you just use someone else's code. Use someone else's code. Deploy it. The workflow is the most important thing half the time. You know what I mean? It's like you need to work out how to get that code, <laughs> download it compile it, run it, and that workflow cannot be underestimated because that your job as a developer is to optimize that workflow. Without any code changes, just getting someone else's code, compiling and running it, that's a huge part of the puzzle. Second time, you make a small change. To be honest, lots of people just keep doing that. Including me. And the second thing is just make a small change. Again, deploy it. And just, you know, you know, make a, uh, you know, instead of a hello world, make it a hello foobar. You know, instead of having a white background, make it a green background or something. That's, that's how you get started. That's all you need to do. Run someone else's code, make little changes. Awesome, right? So, oh my gosh, I really recommend uh, Naomi. She's just awesome, actually. I'm f it's fantastic that people like her have the courage to go on, on this wild, wild internet thing. Um, another YouTuber I come across, he's got, he's only has, has a couple of thousand, um, subscribers. I think he's new on the scene or something. He mainly streams. Um, and yeah, to be honest, I don't really watch streams. I prefer to watch, you know, f a couple of minute video, you know, I'm, you know, I've got no time, but his streams, are, I don't know. He, he, I don't know. He's like my big brother or something. Uh, you know, I feel, you know, since I guess, I guess perhaps I'm just, not getting social nowadays, but like I, I just enjoyed like listening to the guy, and um, his style I guess is closer to mine than um, than say Dev's life, and yeah, he uses Vim. He's coding in Node.js. Typically, I'm I'm coding in Node.js nowadays, and yeah, I'm I'm learning little things in here and there. I'm I'm finding it quite thorough, quite relaxing to watch him code. Actually, it's really weird, and if you want to learn how to code or learn some tips along the way, I, I recommend you just chill out watching this. I mean, what else are you going to do? I mean, at least in Singapore, where we have like a pretty much like still under lockdown. I can't meet more with more than one person. So this is what, this is what I'm doing. You can see all by the, the red lines. I'm, yeah, I'm living the YouTube life. It's fantastic. Not really looking forward to traveling and meeting other devs. So... Yeah. Oh, FYI, I'm going to Germany in Christmas. Anyone around Frankfurt area? Anyway, guys, like the video, subscribe if you haven't already, blah, 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 blah. See ya.